Team is starting to try to do a little bit of spacing, but SSF is on his face. The little dance did not threaten him at all, Rexu. Yeah, absolutely, but Lafty immediately has used burst, something that has to be noted because Chip's offense uh, can be a little bit finicky to deal with. But look at this Latif building a healthy, lively, beautiful 6P again and immediately that block on the burst. Oh my god, Latif is just the first round, but he's already cracked. He has such a mind for the game. He knows where you are going to be and what you're going to attempt. Even if SFS, SSF has some really good unpredictable movement, as you can just see, he just tried to mix them. Latif knows where you're going, but there's such a good 6P. Put a little into the corner again. Off the uh, RC on the overhead, try to make it safe. Still, Latif uh, will not get mixed that easily. Oh my god, the two piece, all blood. And the beautiful jump in with SSM, the combo. Unfortunately, I don't know if that was a drop. We're trying to uh, keep the wall pressure. Fact is, it's a good life lead for SSM, but Latif comes out of the corner. Will he be able to actually do the uh, comeback here? Uh? This does a, quite a bit of damage, Rex. I think that if Latif keeps his cool. Uh, oh, he wants to rebuild Eddie again. Maybe he's. Okay, he plotted correctly. He does, he does have the Eddie, and SSM is trying to open him up again. Does he have the can open already? So he can actually get him out of the can, but no, the team keeps pressuring the amphibious, the drills. Good pressure by SSF on the corner again, tries to open him up, good overhead, and he gets it. Gets the round. Rexus, I don't know which way this is gonna go. SSF is on point tonight, apparently. Ooh, and definitely on point with that uh, air to air, but the gold burst, and Latif will now amount some insane pressure. SSF has to defend. For his life, unfortunately, he's not able to defend us. The Amorphous. Oh my god, look at the damage! Well, like, the, the non recent read that he, just, he didn't hit the, the super, but he still was on his face. And now with the Eddie on top, look at the pressure. He's dead. He took it. He took the first game. Like, there was. My god, what can you do against that? Yeah, uh, basically, just pray, I think, because. Oh no, my god, I don't know if. It was a call out or that was actually like uh, a wall tactic from Latif going uh, because SSF was going to get burst uh, at the next hit even if, if uh, a slight 2p hit him but Latif recognizing it jumping in going for the commander which does such a lot of damage especially against uh, against Chip and just like that it's uh, it's the first round and uh, we have a donation immediately ten dollars from fender with the comment let's go zero uh zero could be the second game in uh, today's wanted going up against hiare but this is uh honestly the first uh, the banger of the show it's starting off and latif immediately putting on the pressure on ssf another gold burst the gold burst into the super into any pressure on the corner this is gonna take quite a bit of damage and he, that's not personal either. Latif knows this. He has slapped the setups. Now with the little claps onto the drill. My drill is a drill with that will pierce the heavens. But SSF says no. Onto the pressure. He has no fear. He kills the Eddie. He. This is the time he needs to try to approach. Oh, there he goes. Come in five feet. This is the time. This is the pressure. And he actually killed the King Rexu. It's definitely within the realm of possibilities. Oh my god, beautiful DP from SSF into the 6k red RC. The wall run combo will actually make the light bars even when he go for the wall setup. No, fortunately, a little bit too close. Unfortunately, there SSF who gets clipped by that 5D. And just like that, Latif takes another round. 
and the amount of pressure that this can exert is just like it's not only the damage that you take it's that the one mistake if you do not cover up the the dust if you do not cover up all the ushers he has he's just going to make you pay for it one opening is all he needs to make you regret actually playing this game maybe i should have stayed in dragon ball fighters maybe i should have stayed in street fighter 5 i don't know but it's just so much mental damage from one bad decision that's the issue. Stripe is definitely a very high damaging game. And look at this! I don't know if that's that. No, good use of burst actually to get out of uh, the corner pressure because that was definitely a very bad situation for SSF. There's a 6k! The burst is big and unblocked! And just like that, SSF PKs some of that momentum. This is really going back and forth. And honestly, SSF is replying in kind to anything that Lucky is throwing at them. Oof, that was a good one now on the, on the knockdown onto the corner, but if he misses, that will not miss Amphibios. Now you need to protect yourself, protect your neck, protect your back. Good jump! He gets him! Oh no, he drops the combo. The Thief will not drop that 6v punish though! And just like that, the life lead is in favor of uh, Latif. There's the jump in. Oh my god, that was a weird interaction. SSF, one touch away. Why are C very unfortunate to be getting? I, I am 100% sure SSF wanted maybe uh, a blue RC or PRC even, I don't know, no, not even a PRC, but the YRC was so unfortunate, it, I don't think it kills the drills, especially since Zato was out of range, something which I learned recently, and uh, yeah, unfortunately, just like that, Latif is already 2-0 up, still, uh, a first to 7 uh, is not made of uh, getting a 2-0 lead, but it's, it's already... Uh, SSF needs to change maybe a little bit, just that little bit, to take a game off of Latif. Otherwise, Latif will just build on his lead. Yeah, because especially when, when you're facing such a matchup, that usually Tato is not one of the stronger characters in the game. It doesn't matter who who of the top players you ask. The few players that actually get use him well, like Infiltration or, or Latif, they have a different way of approaching the game and the situations that they face. They not only lab the amount of uh, combos and neutral and whatever they they amount for what you're going to think in the in the in the fight, and I'm sure that knowing that SSF is a chip player, he needs to play against that aggression with his own hyper aggression on the puppeteer character. It's actually quite impressive. And right now, speaking of that, SSF might make the comeback in this one. He gets it with the counter onto the corner. The mix, no mix. He sees through it. Beautiful bag. There's all this speed. The air DP though. Very smart from SSF. We're still holding on to that burst. Quite smart if you ask me. Again, the corner throw. Will SSF actually make a big comeback in this round? It looks very much still SSF's way. There's the corner pressure. Oh my god, he's actually hurt us! Oh my god, SSF! That was really, really impressive from SSF. He kept his cool. He kept pressure. Uh oh, never mind. As soon as I say it, Amphibius. Into. Dude, that was more than 60% health! Come on, you can. I mean, I don't want to be biased against anyone, but it's just sad to see his health melt like that! Ooh, the block on the cross up again, but as you said, Latif and especially Zato is able to output so much damage, and Chip being uh, the lowest health pool in the game will get mauled just like that. The wall is broken, and Latif brings it back to a dual 3, but. I feel SSF is slowly building momentum and uh, getting some small adaptations as Solatif plays there, but just like that, there's the burst and now SSF has to defend for his life, but a good DP actually will get him out of a hair situation, but again, the gold burst! Latif is so good today with these gold bursts! He's just pointing out where the hold for pressure are, where you're stopping the pressure, and he can just call it out! And that Goldberg just gives him so much advantage because he can just keep using the Eddie. But right now, SSF onto the corner with the pressure. Good grab. What are you going to do? What's the mix? He didn't get it correctly, but he dropped it. The team has a chance to counterattack. It's really smart from SSF blowing in, baiting in the back dash. But just like that, there's a command roll. Oh, the count is on the DP. She's getting blown. The low, the back of the back. Oh my god, this is so tense. One touch can potentially do this. The 6 will whiff jump. Okay, who said that that move was nerfed? Brilliant use from SSF. And the distance is only one game. And that was what we wanted to see. SSF will not lie down and die. 
This is, I think this is going to be very different from last time out. SSF was on point with that. Maybe he can... Oh, you get the, you get the zoom direct zoom. <laughs> I thought it would be longer. <laughs> Think about how SSF is playing right now. Is that... Uh, is, that is that the... the I don't know what it's because I said bucket. So I'm trying to get on to game four. Let's see if, uh, if SSF can actually keep this going. Pedal to the metal, onto the counter hit. No burst from deep. Never mind, he doesn't. He needs some space, some drills. He's putting onto the pressure. Never mind, he calls it out. Good call by him. Onto the mix. Break. What? 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 Up this set, SF not even get to two games last time out, so this is potentially a whole different situation. There's the lead throw! The first time he's bringing it out, there's a 6k, and look at the life lead, is slowly getting bigger, but the back throw from Latif, and the damage, no, it drops the combo! Where I do know if that was a drop, or it was it intentional? I, I never know with Latif, this is gonna kill him, he's gonna be dead! First round goes through that save, so. And uh, again, duel number three, I think. Out of all four games, he has three duel number threes. Step defending for his life, jump 2k. And oh, the six speed though. There's the first immediately used for SSF, and now Latif can uh, try to exploit some good damage against SSF, who is now burstless. Will this actually uh, penalize the chip player though? Look at the score and pressure, beautiful blocks, and that 5d twice in a row. I'm really not sure if what SF needs is to... Oh, that was a great air drop! I was about to say something, but he's dead! No, he's not! Just one sliver of health. He needs to... Never mind, he caught the back there so well. Latif, come on, man! Do you need to stop being so OD? One second! Just a, just a second, man! Like, it's not even fair! By the way, guys, Maturino, we still have a bunch of ghosts left. Even if we are not gonna have the, the, the nice screen with the party, you need to click on that thing and you need to claim it because these guys are given their best so you can have some fun on a Friday night before you go out or stay home, doesn't matter. But come on, they, they need food. They need to survive or something. That's Maybe a kid up. <laughs> it's 22 codes left and uh, it's, uh, it's not a bad point, but come on, chat. Let's do this, but do this after this fifth game between these two and Latif starting off very strongly. As of course, to use Burst, trying to apply some pressure. Oh, 6P actually traded. That was fortunate for SSF, I feel, although now he is in the middle of a sandwich and the Amorphous is going to kill. Oh my god, the damage. Come on, continue. That was so good. Good DP. Gold Burst. Latif, you did not do, did you do that. My boy. <laughs> doesn't mean it! You had so much life when he just burst it to prove that he can do it. Ensef is probably mad about that one. Pressure in the corner. Good tech. Oh, um, Fabius, now your pressure is my pressure. Your combo is my combo. Your life is, is no one's because it's going away. And that is the state of mind. Oh, beautiful jump dust in the meantime. And now SSF. Good combo. There is the mix, but this time it's blocked into the back throw. Actually, I punish another back throw. And just like that, Latif will go 4 1 up. Latif did not like SSF taking one single game because the man has just took it to a whole nother level. And now SSF, it's it's looking quite a bit ugly because those two past rounds were so dominant. And as you said, Latif going for the gold burst with your opponent on one pixel of health. That is the level of confidence that Latif is carrying right now so SSF not only has to defeat his opponent who is a god at the game but he has to defeat the mind of Latif who is now in the zone so it's doubly hard for SSF still not out I did hear like a week ago that Latif was just he was on a roll because he had like this contact in an airline that and he was just booking trips to Brazil for everyone it's like he's giving them away but right now SSF is refusing to do that. He is pressuring him very well. A bunch of HP gone. 
Let's see if he actually can get out of the blade. Good verbal Roman onto the corner. I have a grab, and I have a Sato, and I have a Neddy. I'm gonna pressure you right now. Look at the damage. That's even for saves. Come on, the team. Just, just a second, man. Just a second. Amorphous. Oh my god, that was so good! SSF, the triple jump from Chip, the only character to actually have three jumps and able to use it to perfection jumping about, about jumping up over two supers, that was so good! The, 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 the SSF was just, lit. he's Neo, he's actually played the Matrix fighting game that was never released. Because that's the reaction that you have to have to go first! Come on, the team! How did you even see that? There was no space that... I mean... <laughs> the team! Oh my god! Then a port on the other side, that's the YRC though, killing Eddie in the process, and now... SSF about to apply some major damage! No wall break! Here it comes this time though, very good stuff! Very good round from SSF, who look... Uh, oh, another game actually for SSF! I did not actually realize that that was the, th the second uh, round one that SSF if you got hit. had won. That was a beautiful mix at the wall, and it's 4 2 again. SSF still keeping it within two games, so that's that's good. Uh, it's a personal best for SSF as well because we got to 7 1 last time. Let's see though if Latif will be even more enraged this time. We're not gonna be going to the land of the Capoeira, the Caipirinha, Eddie Gordo, and a bunch of tipping topics that are really offensive. And we're going into the seventh game. Let's see if the tip is more angry than before. Angrier, you would say, if you actually knew how to, spoke, to speak English. And now he's all good six feet onto the neutral once again. And as if jumping up, he drops the combo. He's blocking real well. The birds will keep him away onto the froggy frog, the drilly drills. Latif is just trying everything. Oh, he opens him up. Good so being from uh, SSF at the meantime, but just like that, he gets clipped by one 5D. And your health is really going down the drain. And look at this massive life reach for uh, Latif. Pressing towards the corner. Good jump out of the command throw, but still won't be enough. And Latif will take another round under his belt. And I don't know, it's really looking like. SSF is defending well and Latif is being forced to use burst, but uh, just when Latif breaks out of SSF's pressure, Latif is able to put on his and that has to stop because SSF cannot afford to get pressured by, by Zato because the pressure is just so good. Look at the Clifley. Not only the pressure, he's making the most of every single chance. He has to make some damage. Good fate. Good DP. He still has this. He catches the back dash. The mix! That's a bunch of them! Another mix? He didn't block it correctly! He thought it was only one hit! He's dead! SSF, my man! He is still alive! He not only got out of the plane, he is destroying it slowly, part by part. He's chipping off the wings! Let's see if he actually be able to take off also the engine, but the engine is most the most important part, and that is Latif's brain. The mental is still strong on this one. Look at the defense. Oh my god, the air throw. Latif is so good at countering the jump ins with those air throws, and just like that, the pressure is about to resume. The sword will reset Eddie and break the wall. A hard knockdown as well. Things are not looking good for SSF. We're going with the drills and the claps again. The teeth on the corner pressure. He builds a meter. He catches the back dash with that lower C. On the corner carry, coast to coast. No wall break though. Now you need to guess again. Jump into K. Good tech by Latif. Onto the pressure. He jumps on him. Jello Roman. Now it's my turn. Now you need to guess. But you guessed incorrectly. And now you're dead. He's looking Get long indeed. for man. And yeah, it's looking long. It's 5 2. Still, Next. SSF is putting on an insanely Extension. good performance. I I have to say something though. I I uh, I really love these uh, PRC and BRCs from SSF. The man has loved has loved them so much, and you can see the result. Uh, a, a lot of BRCs have been so critical at the perfect timing from SSF to get uh, the chance at a DP or the chance to throw his opponent. Oh, but Latif still. Even though these godlike RCs from SSF are coming in 
Still at a 5-2 advantage, it's 3 games, let's see if SSF will take another one back, it looks like it's a quite good opening, but Latif still holding on to that burst in the corner. He's trying to steal those turns, like he knows he can actually press a button there, he's hoping SSF screws up, now he does the burst onto the- Oh, BRCDP! He gets him on the corner, now you need to cast Latif, you have no burst, you have no meter, you've been opened up, Latif just got at you! And the and will take it! Again, SSF, you thought he was dead and Latif would be cruising to take all the remaining games, but now SSF is so much alive and look at this. The Rekka into the corner, pressure, beautiful clone, and look, the life lead! Oh no! This could potentially- No, the Coco Joe! It's so unfortunate, gets a big counter hit, and still SSF putting on the pressure in the corner, but Latif only needs one poke! The 2 PO oh no! Back dashes into the frog! I... What? What was all that? What? <laughs> if there was one plane that SSF was going to catch, it was that one to deliver that to Latif. Oh my god, that was such a good PRC to dash right into Latif's face. Oh my god, and it's one game. The difference between these two now, it's getting... It's getting good, Rush. He was... He, he was here, and then he was here with a kick in the face. Like he just got yeeted out of like yeah. <laughs> I think this is a uh, this oh is a meeting. This was uh, premeditated to make us lose our voice before uh, the card actually starts because this is actually the final which was supposed to happen last week unfortunately was not present but he's definitely present now but so is SSF again taking the game to the corner to Latif but the frog takes his opponent out 6-3 again so good from Latif the amount of oh no he's not gonna get let that one pass you are dead as I'm so never mind he's alive how are you even alive you should be dead. My lord, I'm, I'm still in awe of the super dash. That was a bad hit. Like, man, just be fighting his time. He punishes the 6P. The ninja's on the prowl. Onto the corner. Corner pressure. Clone. Gold burst. How did he even. Oh, how did he get. Latif! Why is he in the corner? When did he swap? Rexu! Am I, am I too old to keep up with the action? No, I think if uh, no one is actually too old, perhaps Latif is even older than us, but still, look at the movement! Oh my god, the air throw actually went for the first time in I don't know how many, but look, SSF is now making a full combo conversion into this game, no RC again! There it is this time! I feel that was a little bit lucky for SSF to be able to actually get another 6k in, but just like that, Again, the, du the duel number three will be very important this time because it may put Latif at six games once or SSF once again, reducing the uh, difference to only one game. As a big counter hit, this could potentially do some major damage. Yeah, don't drop it, and this is, come on. Oh, the counter hit, he has a burst to get. He backdashes, he was nothing to do with it. He's HP open down slowly. But this is the reason. Come on, Ezem, I trust in you. You have proven that the thief can bleed. But when a god bleeds, he gets angry. And we hit the ground. So close. It was oh so close. My. I, I, I have to say, Latif was. Latif is really pulling out all the stops. He he summoned Amphib uh, he summoned the amphibian just before going in for the command throw, just to make it safe. Uh, SSF has a habit of when he sees Latif rushing towards him, he's jumping uh, away, and that frog caught him. Again, he went after the war break, and again SSF jumped, and again he got caught by the amphibian. And unfortunately, it is already set point for Latif, but it's still. I don't think that SSF is out of it just yet. Latif is playing out of his mind. He's being forced to, to take out all the tricks in his pocket and get the gold burst! How many gold burst do you have? Why? Latif, you, you are out of your mind, man. Are those guesses? Are you guessing right now? Are you cheating? 
Like, what is going on? He's on point with it. And that grab, the reactions from my man Latif, incredibly on point. Good grab though by SF. He is still in the game. That defeat hasn't actually make it, uh, made him be any... Uh, what's the word in English? He's still concentrated. That's what I wanted to say. Onto the neutral right now. He catches him. He cannot burst out of it. Come on. Oh, oh my god! What the hell? Lottie sniping his opponent out of the air. Out of it. But a beautiful air throw. And the corner situation is reversed. There's the block on the YRC. And this could be big damage. Oh my god. Actually hit. Oh no. Last touch. Final touch. Oh beautiful. 5k. SSF bringing it back from the death. What the hell was that? That was a check, the check to save the matchup. Jump into K onto the pressure. Now the mix in. He needs to block this if he wants to actually win. He's proven that he can hang with the teeth. Now he just needs to hang on a little bit more. Oh no, he doesn't punish correctly. Fortunate burst there, Latif. Uh, unfortunately, not punishing. So SSF uh, can't count his blessings here. Oh, the leaf will actually uh, jump from Latif, but now SSF trying to bring out more layers to his game. Oh my god, that was a beautiful confirm. Off of that 5P and pushing towards, pushing onwards towards the corner. Here we go, and now Chip. Oh, it's a beautiful BRC though, and there's a counter hit in the air. Drops the combo, but still retains the corner pressure. Will he actually make another comeback rush? You got him. Oh, good first. Now you need to make your way in again. And the demon's not gonna make this easy, Rex. You're like, oh no. Speaking of not making it easy, he said, my boy is. Is he? No, he's not. Why is he? This is your chance. Good take by Latif. He was just seeing that coming from a million miles away. Right, the reaction. Oh, big counter hit on that 6P. But another 6P. I have one. Two saves, Latif. And the pressure with the drills. That FD is whittling down the meter, didn't even need the chip damage, and we are now on championship point, who will be the champion to start off today's card of what? we haven't even started the base card, and there's the sandwich, and SSF is the meat in the sandwich, but he's bursting out, and pushing towards making the fourth game, but there's the Morphous, the Morphous will be so much damage, no, it actually whiffs! The thing about it is that it's, it's kind of a reason. I'm not sure if it's intentional or a to drop it in because it didn't see it coming. Oh my god, now you mix up what is going to be your move, NSF. Who is Legit going to correctly guess? He kind of does onto the bridge. No, he catches him. Now SSF is on the defense. He's almost got the meter. Now he can mix him, but Latif has got a burst. What is the end? He needs to. No, he didn't guess correctly the burst. Up to the pressure again, 6 feet! And said, come on, you're still alive! You've proven he bleeds! Don't give up, he gets it! Oh my gosh, the first match of the night! Ninja. Damascus, why do you do this to us? <laughs> the backdash! Oh my god! Sorry, I just uh, transformed, but oh my god, that... SSF was in the zone right there, right here, and right now. He knew he had to defend for his life that block on that 5D into a backdash to get away and then just take home the game. Oh my god, SSF is ascending to a whole nother level. He really is approaching Latif's level here, and it's he, he barely won four games. Imagine what you have to do to win seven against Latif, but it's still very doable. For SSF, although Latif is now angry, the DP is blocked! And he may try to beat out the first face but from SSF to not bait. I mean... I mean... I mean, he's dead! It's been 20 seconds of a round, man! 20 seconds! Latif is tired of actually showing that he has weaknesses, and he's decided that he's going to put an end to this. Unless SSF can actually counterplay it i mean as shaggy saying the song didn't even start man <laughs> and yeah as damascus said ssf has taken the most matches out of latif so definitely a big accomplishment and another big block 
on that 5D, there's the DP coming out of the corner on the overhead. Oh, beautiful fast RC combo. What to walk combo, we got those. Coast to coast, beautiful tech from Latif though. Into the air throw, and now it's getting very airy. SSF using the burst immediately. He does not want to do anything to do with Latif's special, but the command throw will whiff. The air throw will whiff. The 6P will not. Still, SSF catching the back dash into a big out. He has RC. You cannot drop this. Very good. Cool. Jesus Lord! <laughs> now he needs to. No, don't miss that! Don't whip the grab! SSF, you need to play like an actual dot right now! Oh my god, double toast! There's, will there be a triple? No, but still it's a very ugly situation! The 5D will take it, Latif will go. 7 for up will be.